Well, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Whatever time you're watching, welcome back to 7 Days to Die 1.0 Van Life. So, today we are actually venturing off to restore power. I have a feeling that the last episode, whenever I uh, signed off, I was like, oh, I'll just meet you guys over there, because that's normally what I do. Shut up, lady. But I'm looking at the map, and I realized that the restore power quest is actually going to be like in a new area. So I'm like, I'll just record a little bit early, get you guys uh, a little familiar with where I'm going. So town is literally like behind us. What does this person want? Ice cream! Oh man, my bike is like almost wrecked. I really hope we get a mini bike soon. So yeah, we are heading off into like a new area and I did not want to like leave you guys in the dark and be like, oh, this is a brand spanking new town because I didn't realize like it was going to be in a different area. So we are heading towards a working stiffs, I believe, which would be pretty cool. Uh, I do believe I have a, I do have a hammer. I got a wrench and all that. Let's let this town render in a little bit and we'll go check her out while we're waiting for darkness. Well, we have Bernaro Narrowed, and it's just like another quiet town, I guess. It's nothing like too, too crazy. Maybe we'll take a quick tour of it after we're done restoring power tonight, just to see what's what. Maggie's Corner Cafe. I bet you Maggie works the corner. Shut up, dude. So I just got back from a little, little vacation, and yeah, only one bear encounter. So for those of you who are really hoping I was going to croak to a bear, sorry that didn't happen, but... Yeah, no moose either, but we did get a, uh, a little, see, so yeah, on the way out, I did get a little flash flood warning, and I don't know about you guys, but I, all of my life, I have completely ignored those things. Turns out this time, yeah, I did get stranded for like three hours, so that was not the most fun. So we just got to wait two more hours for the working stiffs to get stiff, and we can restore power in here tonight. So this is going to be, like, if you're playing the Navis game map, this will be like the closest working stiff in between yourself typically where you spawn like in the forest and dyersville this will be that one here so this should not be a too crazy one and nighttime will be here shortly so i'll just meet you guys whenever it gets dark and but now 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 sweet all right well whoa i hate it when it does that it like loads in and does like weird glitchy like hey we're trying to load it so yeah clear area restore generator so we Ooh, that crackling buzzing does not sound good to the ears. So at the clear area, um, people, hello, not people, past people, past tense people. So there's some peoples over there. Let's go get our spiky spikes going on because you never know what the first wave of zombies is going to bring you. Let's get, ooh, do we go baseball bat or should we even like go into our skill points real quick? Let's do that real quick. Do I have any skill points to burn up? I do, and let's see here. Infiltrator, use your heightened sense, like, take less damage from traps. I should probably put a point or two into that because, well, I suck at this game. Uh, one second slower for landmines and stuff. That's not gonna, that doesn't matter to me. I'm gonna get my butt kicked anyways. So what we should be doing though, because I complain about it a lot and I really think that the base damage whenever you're doing a sneak attack with melee should be higher as it is. But let's get a couple points into, like, Hidden Strike. And even from the Shadows, we'll do a little bit more um, sneak damage. And then we'll put a little points into moving faster while we're sneaking. That's going to leave us with two points here. Of course, ooh, you know what? Let's get one more into Pack Mule, just because the shite's in the gigs. And Big and Fast is probably not going to be... Uh, you know what? That's Sledgehammer, so what am I thinking? You dumb dumb. And we'll put one more in a machine gunner just because we use that a lot on Horde Night. Ammo is kind of 50-50 on uh, whether they're going to have enough to survive or not. Whatever they're doing out there does not sound pleasant. Check the toolbox. All right, some duct tape. Duct tape is always needed. My dude, you're not part of this. Nobody's your friend, dude. Because you are like the one that shows up uninvited and everyone's like, oh, let's get away from, from druggy over here because nobody wants to be near you. And then there, yeah, that's what you get. So, do we have anybody that we can kind of get, like, a sneak shot on? Ooh, we can't open that door. That was a toe shot. Come on, that's shenanigans right there. All right, buddy, let's see what you got. Oh, you're just Steve. I like your outfit, my dude. So, I put down these spikes hoping that these guys would be coming attacking me. Should I... Oh, yeah, that bleed damage. That's cool. Get wrecked. What are you guys hung up on? Ooh, how you guys doing? 
No, come on, this way. Do the spikes, do the spikes. Yeah. Let him wreck himself a little bit. Oh, I want to pop your belly so bad. Um. Come on, I should get the XP for that. That is shenanigans. So do we loot as we go here? Like, I know like there's a few raw materials I do need, and I should probably start gathering that kind of stuff. Murky water. whoop de doo yeah, let me loot this. If there's, if there's anything cool, I'll let you guys know. But for the most part, it's going to be like Rotten Flesh, which I should not have picked up twice. I, I That's force I have it. All right, last toilet. Give me... Oh my gosh, they're all toilet paper. Weak sauce, weak sauce, weak sauce. So I think we have to go this way, correct? Correct. We'll search this shelf right quick before we press further. Lock picks. Glad I looked at the shelf. I really did not pick up anything crazy. Uh, some mechanical parts. Get rid of this paper, which I'm not going to be using, but... That's so easy to come by anymore. Nothing fantastic. Here's somebody sheeping. Really? Nobody? That's a load of weak sauce there. Well, let's go check. Ooh, got a little yucca smoothie. Charred meat is not the greatest find in the world. Gonna leave those chairs for now. A little brown dye to go with my brown something else. Check these boxes. All right, nothing crazy. Nothing crazy yet. Boner. That's where I usually put my boners into a box. That's locked. Sweet. I think we're gonna move on to out back here. So what are you guys thinking? Like, am I gonna get like a spider monkey, a dog, or a cat lady? Do not have my money on cat lady. Anything back here worth looking at besides this car? I hear that. I hear that. What? Holy moly, that map got a little, little Christmassy. Sweet. Well, let's go loot this while we're here. I saw like a, what was it, like a level 5 club. whoop de doo Crunch your little face. And what all did we get from that? I kind of panicked out of there. Level 5 wooden club. We can get some wood out of that. Because <laughs> bones and wood. Ooh, I like how high we jump the parkour. Whee! <laughs> all right, up we go. That sounds like a good thing to do, right? Let's go up. All right, come on, birds. Gonna turn in like a stereotype. So, batters up, jiggle physics. What were you guys doing up here, I wonder? Oh, you're coming up to say hi. <laughs> Off you go. Hold on, cat lady, I'm trying to see what jiggle physics is up to. Shit. My word, she's like a toddler. Turn around, she's like right up your anus. All right, off you go. Off you go, sweet, fantastic. Moving along here. Is that a plug? Ooh, old trash. That's, yep, that's worth hiding back there. Cool beans. We'll loot that. Leg action. All right. Get our breakfast going. Anything else up here noteworthy? Kaka, mother trucker, where are you? Why are you hiding trash back there? Like, that's whatever. So I hear a seepy boy. Where's your seepy boy? Oh, yep. That's a seepy boy. That's a CP boy. That's a CP boy. Very CP boy. Hi, CP boy. Get wrecked, sweet. I like it when dogs are. Steve. Oh, shit, that's the wrong button. That is the wrong button. There we go. I like it when dogs are not as much of a threat. And it's kind of like uh, whenever you play like a lot of the old console version, you, you tend to start fearing dogs a lot when you switch over. And you. At least in my instance, I forget. Oh, I wanted to search that. I often forget that dogs are not as fierce in this version until they start piling up on you. I assume there's nothing else back there. Jeez, um, hello. How are you? Loose Lois, how you doing, girl? Hit her in the pooter. Uh, I believe that this is the only like thing we have to worry about, right? Bazinga, we got power back at the working stiffs. Why are we restoring power? Nobody knows. Like, for real, like, there's not enough people alive in the world to justify trying to inhabit the city again when it's just overrun with zombies. Restoring powers are great, fantastically fun missions. They just don't make a whole lot of sense to me. And a loot, and we will go. What do we have in the first working stiff crate? Nerdy Magazine Day. Sweet. And some nerd poles. Fantastic, because Lord knows I need those. There's no zombies in here, right? Sweet. Let's check the trunk here. 
All right, some gloves to dismantle. We have a little nerdy magazine action. Impact bracing mod. Lord knows. If I can attach that, I will because... Oh, I'm going to keep my load up the way it is. I do have parkour cranks, so we should be okay for now. But the way I jump off of stuff, I'm going to need that more nerd pole action. All right. And what? Working a stiff box. What do you got for me, dude? Nudie magazine, little needles and threads. This guy right here. And Nudie magazine day. Some more cobblestone. You know what? This POI, I'm not overly impressed with uh, its lack of awesomeness. Last one's Nudie Magazine, five pieces of forged iron. Like, what's the, why do I put points into Watchahooser? That's where I came from, right? Back here? Aha! Oh-ho! I put so many points in the Lucky Looter, and it's not giving me a whole heck of a lot in return. What were you two doing together, I wonder? You probably, like, said, like, oh, I'm going to buy you all these flowers and the apocalypse hit, and that's who they are. Sweet, cool beans. Is there anything else in the nursery here? That's got to be outside because we've been airing around. You are. All right, and that's the last plant that I'm going to loot. Let these guys do their thing. I should have probably come with a shovel. I never think about this stuff. Holy moly donut shop. Excuse me. Ready, set, chi ching I'm out of here. Cool beans. So we are going to be working on organizing our inventory real quick, even though we did not get a whole heck of a lot. Like, this is nothing to really brag about. But I'm really thinking that we are going to hit up that uh, Resident Evil-looking mansion. I did not confirm that. that I, for whatever reason, I cannot talk today. So we're going to go sort inventory. All this stuff, going to go home, get that sorted. Then we're going to go hit that Resident Evil house. I'm not sure if it is or not. I have not like really looked into it that much. So, yeah, we're going to get organized, go pick up our next job. But in the meantime, day 13, we'll be over at that mansion. Hopefully it's not like this uh, this sick skull going to whoop my butt too, too much. But I got a feeling if it's anything like the last place that I explored, which was that military camp, I'm going to probably die once or twice. What's out here? Flesh Beast Halls. What? Is it just like a pit? Like put the lotion on the skin or it gets the hose again? Oh, I'm a lumberjack and I'm okay. Oh, dude, come on, dude. Swing like you want to hit the zombie. All right, cool. Anyways, oh, Florence, I'm so sorry. Whatever happened to you, happened to you. Now, is this supposed to be like, ooh, nudie magazine? Like, what's in this pit beside that dude? Like... Is that bait up there? Oh, it is kind of like bait. All right, so I'm going to assume this is like a zombie trap. What are you doing over here? Buddy. Eh? Beauty magazine day. Sweet. Backpack, backpack. Animal fat. All right. Well, kind of cool. Don't 100% know what this is from because there's a thousand different things this could be referencing, but interesting. Cool. What time is it? Oh, it's getting early in the morning. Sweet. Wreck them, but I didn't we agree shut your face. Your first job was going All to right, crafting skill magazine Damn. or Night Stalker Volume oh, Seven. Let's uh, let's pick up the Night Stalker. We'll uh, do a little bit more damage. Now, let me see what jobs you have, right quick. Infested clear. That that Listen, that's one of my heck, other other, other, other favorites. Something for me. Hogfoot built well, short. Good luck. Sweet. By the looks of it, you're gonna need it. So quest completed. Restore power. Fantastical. Now let's uh. Dude, I was just out here. Why Why are you here now? All right, cool. Bye. Anywho, so let's head on over to the uh, the creepy mansion over yonder. Did you shut up back there? And yeah, we'll go explore that. Ta-da! We have made it. I should get a thumbnail at the right residence. All right, getting thumbnails and what's that on the horizon? Something else to do after here. We have an airdrop yonder now. Yonder to airdrop will be all the way over there near our tier two infestation. How about them apples? I know what we're doing after this. Sweet. Yeah, I I, I took off my bats. So I can get a thumbnail and the airdrop came. So that's that's where we are. All right, thumbnail has been achieved. Let's go whack off this dude. He looks like he needs a good whacking. There he goes. Now, let's see what's in the mailbox here. A little tactical warfare. Sweet. 
What is, oh, that's my Night Stalker. I should probably read that because Lord knows it'll be nighttime quick enough. So welcome to the right residence, which I am 99.3% sure is the uh, Resident Evil mansion. Jeez Louise, my dudes. Oh, lordy, lordy. I, I um, yeah, so cool. We, uh, we got a few peeps out here. Cool beans. I was really hoping to hold on to my traps for a later moment inside of the uh, POI, but my dude. Like, I know I've been, like, on vacation-ish. Like, I, I took a couple days away. I was far out of cell phone range. But I didn't think I'd lose, like, all ability to play video games. Like, I am very horrible at video games, obviously. But geez louise, the swings and misses and the lag fest whenever I whack somebody in the face getting a little annoying, too. I uh, had all my electronics turned off when I was gone, so I'm assuming something's probably up auto updating in the background. Come on, guys. We have one skill point to burn, sweet. Big mama. Oh my gosh. Nothing. I am so disappointed that Big Mama did not try to get a hold of me while I was gone. Oh my girl. Yeah, you take that spike. You know, I know you like the wood. Alright, nurse Jackie. I would not stick anything in you. You're probably infected even more. Yeah, she missed me. <laughs> she was infected by something before the apocalypse even started. That face like that? Yeah, that does not happen with the zombie disease. Cool beans. Inside we go. This is such a cool POI, dude. So cool. Alright. Who wants to say hi? Fancy pooper. I heard something growling. TP, come on guys, start stashing more stuff in your... You know what, if we normalize stashing cool things in our toilet, they'll have to add it to the game. Hey, what's up? So yeah, everybody do me a favor. If you're, uh, you know, about to get somebody to look in your toilet, just, just go on TikTok, go on Shorts, Instagram, stash stuff in your toilets. That way the fun pimps will see that that is a normal everyday activity and they will put cooler stuff in toilets. Alright, so far we've gotten Jack. Hello? Who's in here? What's up, homie? Oh, you look like you're going through withdrawals. I am so sorry, my dude. Oh, you're dead. Sweet, cool, fantastic. Ooh, nice little hidden shelf. Nice little use of, like, the behind your staircase um, space. What do we got here? Big head is fantastic. No progression on the bat building yet. Armored up, though. I'm fairly certain we can make the tier three. Ooh, fish tacos. Tier three, watch your who's our armor. Let's look at our character real quick. Yeah, we are still rocking the tier two. One of these days, since we get a few more resources, we will up our armor. Hey, body. Hey, body. Hey, body. Jiggle physics. Why you gotta hide, dude? You afraid, like, contractor's wife's gonna get home or something? Or are you the wife and he was the contractor and the husband was coming home? <gasps> Ooh. The story's getting juicy. Try to lock me out, my dude. All right, cool. There's a flashlight looking at some medical supplies here. Some bandages. Lord knows I will need those. <laughs> it's got wood. Actually, you know what? With the wood, we should probably try to up our spike game a little bit. More we at 21. So I'm fairly certain this mansion goes a little bit deeper. <laughs> Something I can't do. And yeah. So up the stairs we go. Up the stairs we go. Right, right. <laughs> right, residence. Excuse me? Ooh, back in there. All right, you guys are cranky pants outside. Ooh, a safe. And I didn't do that. Joints haunted. Come on, nurses. Those doors open, right? Like, I'm not tripping. All right, cool. Like, I'm, I'm a little, little tiny smidgy, like what the hell happened there but yeah now there's almost never anything in these things but let's see what's in here some uh ammunition and a weighted head mod which is good for something right it's good for uh crushing blows to the face uh stun victim that's that uh, sons of victims that's the words i was looking for so oh uh, hang on what is all the crankiness coming from stop being a dick let me in cool all right hello Hello! While you're down there, tie my shoe. Nope. Uh, let's see here. Anybody want to hang out? Not really. 
Kerspausch. Ooh, that's a cool sound effect. I'm going to start using that more often. Kerspausch. Hello, here's Johnny. Crack your face. Like, look at that. Like, like I'm sure if you're like a horse, like that, uh, that loose jaw is probably more beneficial. But for me, it's probably like a hot dog in the hallway. Are you gonna help? Thank you for your assistance, young la lady. Boom, boom, boom. I want you in my room. Ooh, sneaky ladder. Now there's some nudie magazines here. I should be reading. All right, here we go. That's gonna be nothing. Big hitters, big hitters, big hitters. Baseball back quality three. Sweet. So today we'll be going back to base after we're all said and done here. I'm going to make a new baseball bat. I'm going to probably wait until armor gets to tier like four. Then I'll start making some more of my armor set here. I'm going to probably stick to like the preacher outfit because I do like the damage mitigation. Hey, body. I was expecting you. Well, there's going to be a ton of nudie magazines. Like, I guess if you had a mansion like this, you're probably old money, don't quite have the internet, and magazines are the way you're going to go. Don't be busting out my books! No. Well, that's, I guess that's a plug. It's supposed to happen. Okay. There you go, little lady. You! I... I'm not at all in the mood for that stuff, okay? Um, one of these buttons has what I'm looking for. That is why we have Spiky McSpicer... Spiky McSpicersons? Spikersons? Spicersons? Yeah. We got spikes for this reason here. Come on. Dude, like, you're not overly scary. Unless you're about to kill me. Then, then, then I'm a little bit worried. A little bit nervous about it. Alright, do a little reload action. Now you, good sir, are just causing more problems than I need right now. There you go. 3,600 points for that kill. That is what I'm talking about. Are we cool enough to go get some nudie magazine action? What's our food? We can probably get some natural healing going by eating some bacon and eggs. One thing I really wish Big Mama would do for me is cook me more bacon. So anyways, Nudie Magazine schematic, Duckville Shotgun. Maybe if this series goes on for a long time, I'll start building mods. Because for the most part, I feel like mods are just something you can loot in this game. Nudie Magazine schematic, so you know, you can't complain with them. Ooh, Burning Shaft schematic. I can read up more on what's causing my issues here. The Armored Up action. Ten percent more damage to vultures. I'm not gonna complain, even though they are still kind of like a one-hit wonder there. Ooh, pipe baton quality four. You know what? Like I like the baton. It's like a oh mother trucker. It's a really good like early. Ooh, learn to craft cigars. You know what? That's something I always really wanted to do was uh, roll my own cigars. I think I've done it like once. A friend had a kit, and I, I can't say it was the best cigar ever. Pipe machine gun quality four, sweet. I was saying something beforehand. I got distracted by cigars. Mini bike. Sweet. All right. So if we do not get the mini bikes from the trader soon, I think I'm going to end up just crafting that myself. Pipe machine gun quality five. Ooh, fancy. All right. Another uh, grip mod schematic. Fantastic. The last one's another big hitters. 23 out of 75, so we're not going to be upping our baseball bat game anytime soon. 12 pieces of glue. Not at all going to complain about that. <laughs> Wood. Cool beans. I think that is everything in here looted. Now the elevator is unlocked. Yeah, yeah. Sweet. Ooh, don't get hurt. Don't get hurt, my dude. Okay. Come on, come on. Easy money, easy money. Sweet, fantastic. Oh, that's, I thought this was a stash. <laughs> um... Hmm, this drop. 50-50 on this is going to hurt or not. All right, cool. Down we go. Oh, there's a ladder right there. Sweet, fantastical news. Lawrence, how you doing, girl? It's been a minute since I've seen you. All right, cave exploration. Here we come. Ooh, baby. Now, are we doing this backwards? I think that that's like the way out, right? Right. So we might be getting towards this. Oh, hi, dude. We might be getting towards the stash sooner than expected. Oh yeah, your hazmat suit can protect you from my burning shaft. Crack a book. Ooh, some more nudie magazines for you and me. 
Hey, arrow rest mod, because I'll, I'll totally use that at some point. Big hitters, we are slowly but surely getting towards our next baseball bat, which would be very fantastic. Although three should be okay. <clears throat> uh -huh. <laughs> All right. Slightly nervous about that. Uh, I don't want to go in there quite yet. Let's go make sure we're not missing any... Oh, we could have just gone this way. Oh. Oh. What's really cool about exploring POIs like this sooner than, like, required by questing... Oh, it's going to be so nasty in there. I don't even... Like, I, I, I want to do it. Uh, red pipe, red pipe, red pipe goes into here. Red pipe, red pipe, red pipe. I knew it! I was, I was expecting it. I was ready for it. Hi. Should have probably brought my machine gun thinking about it now because it's going to get hairy if I go towards that main stash. Which I'm not, like, overly sad about. Like, it's part of the game, getting yourself a little in too deep. Because, again, that's the only time I can go too deep. Oh, cool beans. That blue pipe. Blue pipe, you look like you go yonder. Hello? That's a big pipe. That's a pipe she told you not to worry about. Oh, blue pipe! <laughs> that's a pretty dramatic entrance. Sweet cool beans. I could have probably used that gate that opened up, but uh oh well. Oh you're uh you got them pretty eyes, don't you? Oh my girl. Now you back the frig up, lady. I don't know what mood you think I am in, but it's not one no, you're bleeding. <laughs> and you're on fire, sucker. It's not that type of mood. Let's just throw on a bandage, because we've already gotten one or two on this journey already. We can afford to burn one. 30 seconds of heal time. Hurt nothing. Cheese them, Louise them. Would you just go down like you normally do? Go ahead, boy. Go ahead. Get down. Now you, you're not pretty eyes? You don't have the pretty eyes. I... Ooh, that dislocated jaw of yours. Sweet, there's the green pipe. Is that all the pipe? If we laid all the pipe, yellow pipe, is that something we still got to get? I think so. Here to lay some pipe and take some names. Hey, fellers. Thanks for dropping in. So I'm feeling like this is going to be a bit of a longer episode, which I'm okay with. If uh, that is something you do not like, I'm sorry, but... Ooh. Okay, my dude. Gee, oh, you're both cuties. Cool. Like, I, I still want to limit some episodes to like half an hour long, but the 40 minute ones, it's kind of... The way I look at it, before when I was like targeting 30 minutes, I was like, well, it's because people are watching on their lunch breaks. But then I was like, you don't have to watch the whole episode. You can come back and watch the end. So yeah, I'm, I'm, this is going to probably be a longer episode, but at the same time, it's 50-50 it's on whether or not I'm upset about it. Do I have to turn that? Me is... Maybe that was not a good idea. <laughs> But yeah, I, um... Ooh, some shotgun shell sweep. So if you don't like the longer episodes, then tell me about it. I'll, uh... I knew it. Knew it, knew it, knew it, knew it, knew it, knew it, knew it. Scroll wheel, come on, scroll wheel, come on. All right, cool. So if we can kind of more or less make our defensive positions right here. And we're just going to keep looping around. Just keep swimming, right? Just keep swimming. Just keep swimming. Oh, uh, this not a mistake, but I am. I'm feeling it, dude. I'm feeling it, dude. Feeling it, dude. More or less concentration mode. That's uh. Come on. You are not supposed to be all topsy turvy, whippy curvy like that. Come on, guys. Oh, you're uh, you're you're cutie patootie, aren't you? Level one pistol. That's 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 the best gun you could have thought to bring to this, right? Yeah. You dumbass, Steven. I yelled at myself with a hard end, dude. I am not happy with myself, apparently. <laughs> Come on, spike the spikes. Yeah, you like that, don't you? You like this! You freaking like it! And then... Oh, right in my own spikes. You freaking dumb dumb. Oh, come on. You know you like it. Come on, right in the spikes. Sp nope, no, you can't dip dodge dukes and yeah boy no loot bag 
Disappointment. All right, cool. Well, our health did not suffer too, too much. Let's get some gasoline out of here. Anything else to loot in here? Oh, man. That was a bit, bit tight. You know what I'm saying? A little, little pucker action going on there. Oh, it's nighttime. I did not... Ooh. Mistakes may have been made, everybody. Mistakes may have been made. Now, how many lockpicks do I have? I have nine lockpicks. Ah, oh, I, I, I doubt that I'm going to get in here. This might be one of those episodes where I have to fast forward through, um, whacking. I didn't, oh, I did bring my pickaxe, though. And three lockpicks is all it took. Sweet, fantastic. These athletic shoes. Don't mind if I do. All right, nudie magazine schematics. We are absolutely going to take that stuff. Holy moly, not a bad little find. We're going to probably be encumbered by the time I'm done looting, but that is A-OK. -okay. Level 3 baseball bat. That's going to get slapped on right away. Let's get uh, magazines read. I might even read the magazines I have just so I don't get too encumbered. Passing gas. Whoop-de-doo. Nothing fantastic except for the, uh, the bike wheel, which we're probably going to need. Working stiffs. All right, level four iron shovel. I'll take that because I don't think my current shovel is that fantastical. And last but not least, Shamway box. Sweet. Uh, are we encumbered? We're encumbered by three. I can take care of that pretty darn quickly. Is there anything else of like significance up here? I don't believe there is. Is there? No, this is where we came from. Sweet, fantastical news. Let's get back over, huh? Shimmy, shimmy, cocoa perf. All right, before we go up, I'm going to sit here. I'm going to go through my inventory. I'm going to swap out my mods, my shoes. I'm going to get all the cool stuff. The baseball bat. Okay, what? Before we go too far. Baseball bat and shoes are the only things that we're really going to swap out though, right? Right. Cool, let's do that. All right, our inventory is sorted. I equipped and repaired the baseball bat, threw our mods on there. Had those athletic shoes on there. The lumberjack boots... They're um they're good for when you're sprinting. They uh, reduce stamina usage. I I'm okay with uh I'll show you what the, the uh, words. So this is increased run speed. So like it's a 50 50. But the thing is like the athletic shoes obviously much more better protection. So they kind of oh that's locked. I have to do the old school way to get out of here. Yeah. So anyways, athletic shoes. Kind of give and take. They, they really equal the same at the end. I'm going to try to make my way out of here, and then we can go do the airdrop in our next mission and then call it a fancy pantsy day. And good morning, sweet, cool beans, shish kebabs on a stick, all that fun stuff. Let's head on over to Trader Rectum. So before we head out, I brought all the stuff that's in our uh, Trader box here. Uh, And our Duke toys. Toys. Shut the. F oh, that's right. I left you in here, my dude. I'm sorry for uh, keeping your cage overnight. <laughs> Hope Rectum didn't play the Rectum too much. All right, my dude. Let me see what you got. All right. And do you have a Crucible by chance? He does not have a Crucible by chance. Does have some concrete mix. We might have to keep that in mind, but they almost always have concrete mixes available. Sweet. Now, I'm going to put my coinage in the bike. We'll head on over to that airdrop right quick, and we'll do that uh, infestation. Clear infectedness. <laughs> Whatever the hell I'm trying to say here. I have a bunch of stuff in here, too. Interesting. Rawr. Sweet. Look how close that is. Sweet, sweet, sweet. So let's see what's in here. All right. Antibiotics. I was just thinking to myself, like, if I'm, I might had to, uh, might had to have run to Trader Gen, like, overnight and uh, pick up some antibiotics because I do not have any honey or anything like that to fight off the infection. So, and chances are, if this is an infested clear, you know darn well that I'm going to be picking up some sort of illness here. Alrighty, ooh, this place looks so fancy. Where is the entrance? There's the entrance. Oh, good lord, it's the Raiders. Anybody who's played Fallout knows exactly what's in here. For now, now this. So we have done this uh, encampment before, which in the uh, the jellies of my bellies, I feel like is going to become like a bandit camp at some point. So don't get too attached to this location. Uh, are you infested? You're infested. <laughs> Bonk your noggin in there. Any? Oh, I was about to say, I'm going to keep an eye on my compass whenever start stuff starts moving is when I'm going to start panicking. 
I believe, what are we at? Six or... S well, that's going to be eight is going to be our uh, Spiky McSpikerson. So, I'm going to keep that in mind whenever it really starts to hit the fan to throw those down. Hello? Ah. Ho, <laughs> Tubbs McGee over there. Thinks he can get away from me. Ready? That's right. And if we get these... Okay, it's a double-wide hallway, just like a double-wide trailer, which is a great place to live if you do not like the things... I don't know where I'm going with that. I'm trying to concentrate on the... Dick? <laughs> God dang. All right, what is a good fallback position we have right here? What the hell just hit me there? Barbed wire? All right. Sweet. Well, let's get this kind of situated a little bit for these munchkins coming out. Uh, I wanted to open up that door. Come on. And by not stepping on my own darn sparks. Come on, ladies and germs. Come on. You dingus. No. You want to play like that? Well, then, you. Down goes you. Down goes you. Knuckleheads. My dude. Got places to be, homie. Sweet, sweet, sweet. So that is taken care of. Let's uh, try not to wreck ourselves in here too much. Let's even be smart enough to crack through this. Look at that. Us working with the environment. That door's locked. Anybody else want to give us some kisses? Does that, does that lead to kisses? That does not lead to kisses. All right. Ooh, little, little stash here. Medical supplies. Nudie magazine day. Sweet. We'll take that. Sorry to interrupt the poop. I know, oh, hi. That's like one thing I really hate. Like, I poop a lot, and in the mornings, if something's interrupting my poop, I am not a happy camper. In fact, if you leave a comment, chances are I'm replying to it while I'm the pooper. Oh, hi. Oh, cat lady in hazmat. You know what? I know there's a certain somebody out there who, um, got a thing for the cat lady, but looks like she's already taken by hazmat dude that can just tank all damage. Cool beans. Hello. My throat's getting dry. I got coffee beside me. I should be here. My baby. Hey, sweetheart. Oh, and look, she's running to give me a hug. Oh, my girl. Excuse all of you while I get the hell out of here. I want some alone time with my girl. <laughs> all right. Oh, my boo, my boo. How the frig are you, dude? Uh-oh. This is not turning out to be happy hunky horror days. Let's uh, keep falling back a little bit. I know I got... I'm infected. Flippin' knew that was gonna happen. Just wanna slowly but surely... Come on, come on, girl. I want some alone time. Get in here. Uh oh Yeah, girl. Oh, my goodness. Just look at that, dude. Even without the leg, man. Mm. She is a sight for sore eyes. Hit you in the cross. Don't even think about trying to tag my girl, dude. Yeah, you can't tag without a wiener. <laughs> Up your butt. Come on, homie. Come on, homie. Come on, homie. Come on, homie. <laughs> Pathetic. I ain't worried about these guys taking my gal. Are you uh you still trying to decide how to get to me, huh? Feral biker, dude. Like, I would expect you guys to be a little bit more scarier. But of all the ferals, jeez, cat lady, regular cat lady is scarier than a feral biker, dude. I take back what I said. He's still not scary. All right, backpack, backpack, take back that crap, son of a biscuit. You know, I'm not overly upset. It's not a permadeath series, but that was like one of the last dudes we had to take care of in order to have this infestation cleared. My dude, I'm not in any sort of mood right now. Gosh darn it. Slightly irritated. Slightly irritated. A level one pipe baton. Gee, thanks. Totally worth my time being here. All right. Again, nothing, nothing crazy up here. So it wasn't even gonna be worth my time. This stupid game. 
I'm not upset, I promise. Alright, well, let's take our antibiotics, head back to the trader, go tell him we suck at life. Can't wait to hear the end of it. Well, I won't hear the end of it if the trader wrecked him. You know what? It's 8 in the morning on day 13. Not gonna complain too, too much. Yeah, I suck, wreck them. Get over it. Hey, jackass. Can hey, jackass yourself. Back, back All me? right, so restore power. Not really in the mood for that. Infested clear. We have hey, to redeem Jared. ourselves with that one. Some work? The Kenvin residence? Sure, we'll take that. I am wet. Boof, riggedy who. Before we go, let's take a crack at our crafting skill magazine bundle. What we have here, some new magazines of the Southern Farming. Fantastic. Tier 1 aloe. Ooh. We got electrical traps. Sweet, fantastic. We'll forge ahead action. Now the farm bundle itself. What do we have here? Some farm plots, more southern farming. We do have some seeds, so I think I'm going to do... I'm going to go set up my, uh, maybe a little farm, get that going. And then I'll probably just go meet you guys over at the next quest, which we'll do in the next episode. So that'll be the rest of day 13, and then next episode will include day 14. That means day 15 will be more or less preparing for our day 15 horde. Sweet, cool, which will be, what, Saturday's episode? Awesome, fantastical, sweet. Thank you all so very much for watching. I appreciate each and every one of you. I hope you all have a great day, and I'll catch you in the next one.